Good day to you and welcome to Supermatics Online Math YouTube channel again. In today's math tutorial, we want to solve this radical equation 3 root x equals to 2x minus 5. So the first thing we do is to square both sides. So when we do, we have 3 root x all squared. And on the right hand side, it is the square of 2x minus 5. And the square of 3 is 9, while the square of root x is x, as the square cancels the square root. Then, expanding what we have on the right hand side, we have 4x squared minus 20x plus 25. So, at this point, we try to subtract 9x from both sides. On the left hand side, we'll be left with 0 because 9x minus 9x will be 0. And on the right hand side, it is going to be 4x squared minus 20x plus 25 minus 9x. We can then regroup to have 0 equals to 4x squared minus 20x minus 9x plus 25. Uh, we could swap sides also so that we have um, 4x squared minus 29x plus 25 equals to 0. And we then try to factor 4x squared minus 29x plus 25 equals to 0. But this time around, we'll be using the slide and divide method, uh, which means that using the slide and divide method, we can write this by sliding 4 to 25 to multiply it, leaving us with x squared minus 29x plus 100 equals to 0. That's the sliding part of the slide and divide method. We're going to go for the divide later. Now, what we consider is the factors of 100 whose sum we give negative 29. And this should be negative 4 and negative 25. Hence, x squared minus 29x plus 100 is going to factor as x minus 4, x minus 25 equals to 0. And at this point, we take the divide aspect of our slide and divide method. Dividing every second term in the bracket by the 4 that we used in sliding earlier on. And this gives us x minus 4 over 4, x minus 25 over 4 equals to 0, which is x minus 1 x minus 25 over 4 equals to 0. And by the zero product property, x minus 1 could be 0, or x minus 25 over 4 could be 0. So that finally, the values of x for which the radical equation holds true will be x equals to 1, or x equals 25 over 4. To see more of our math tutorial, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Click on the notification bell so that you do not miss out on any updates from this channel. Until we see you again in our next math tutorial, say thank you and have a lovely day. Bye.